way higher than we actually are. Third floor things. Third floor. Third floor things. I gotta come with the hat. My hair looking kind of crazy. Probably couldn't really tell. Could you? I turned just feel dry. I can't tell in the video. I feel like my drink flat. It's giving, I've been laying in the bed. I've been, <laughs> I got the bed head, yo. Sure. Straight bed head. We about to go out tonight, though. Get it popping. Get some things cracking out here in Vegas. With the, <laughs> the New York, New York. Is that New York, New York? Oh, yeah, for sure. New York, New York, New York, New York. How can I get it better? Right? Can I... Get it better one Little bit of you. That's so cute. Look at that lamp. That view is better than what you had it. God, uh, she don't ever want to be on camera anyway. Let's so. <laughs> go live again. You said what? Go live. Well, this ain't a live, but it's a little video. We out here, Vegas. You enjoying yourself? Having a good time. Just went to some local spot, Mr. Fry's Man. Black owned restaurant. Would you, um, what would you score your, um, your black restaurant score? You went to two places. Are you two Fry's? <laughs> <laughs> My choice is I'm, two and I give it a, a I'm two for two. You two for they two. They was black owned. They was black owned. But you know, I just know a bit about money circulation and whatnot. How it's going to come back. You know, the purpose of going to black owned are those to keep the support money circulating. the community. You know. Those seem Nowadays, I don't think that's the same sentiment. I think now people say black be. owned and a black person getting money, but they going. They're just happy to have one. Away. Yeah, because that, that first one was definitely going to the LGBTQ community and the Caucasian community because I didn't see any black people in her pictures. Uh, in any. And it was a handful in the restaurant. This other one was very black, Mexican, black, Native American, maybe. But, you know, they're playing a little break the black card, I guess. Eat okra. Eat okra is a. I wonder, do they just, like, what's the process of getting posted on the website? I know, right? Do you just pay probably your subscription? How do you verify? Sure. Maybe. <laughs> I mean, you know, somebody, somebody's doing anything. Black owned, but Mr. Fry's man, and that, that even that food, that was very street yes. Mexican. Like, yes, I didn't even think that. Like, you are. Right. It was very like other cultured, inspired, inspired flavors. for sure. Yes. Yeah, 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 yeah. But you know, hustle, hustle man shouted him out, so I went to a spot that hustle man picked it up. Nope. They didn't even know that. They threw it at the end of their joint, <laughs> italicized, like uh, MC Hustle shouted us out. Had some good, the food was definitely better than that heart, heart attack place. Yeah. That was a slight disappointment in the beginning. This is a good view. Park MGM. I can't. I guess I can't talk about this hotel enough. Like it was decent, nice views, and everybody wants those that that view in New York. Like you're either going to stay there, or you want the external view of that room. This whole thing is the hotel. That whole thing is the hotel. Yeah. Is this all one hotel right here? Yeah. yeah. That's huge. Wait, this is a whole thing. Yeah, these all of these hotels are huge. The desert, they ain't have nothing but space to do their thing. And then 
other hotels came along and just squeezed their sofa in between. Like, we're just gonna take this. We're just gonna squeeze it. <laughs> yeah, right. Excuse me. A little space. Vegas, ready to go traveling. Where's your next destination? My next destination? Yeah. New Orleans, probably. New Orleans. So what is it about DC that you can't, you just don't like driving in there? Would you drive in another city though? I'm probably more likely to give it a chance. At another city? Yeah. Interesting. Cause I already had my mind made up about DC. That's crazy, the um, roller coaster going off in the background. This was a good view. This was, yeah, definitely better than the, the nighttime view. Cause you can actually see. Yeah. It almost looks fake. It almost looks like a. Um, it does, like a, a little digital. backdrop. Yeah. But yeah, I'm having a good time in Vegas. Doing the thing. Ready to go tomorrow. Back on the flights. Jet setting. I wish I could show you the room, but it's a mess. My rooms, yeah. Most of my hotel rooms be a mess. Unless I'm like staying there for an extended period of time, then I might like try to keep it proper, but a little quick three day weekend. Everything's coming out of the suitcase. Everything's probably on the floor. There's tags everywhere on my room. It's just so crazy. Because the trash can is right there. Popping tags, I know, I gotta, I came in this joint and made a mess off the rip, like, just drop it on the floor and just oh, tore it up. <laughs> yeah, you ain't got no entertainment on the, on the flight? Uh, no music. That's what you was on coming down? Mm -hmm. What you listening to nowadays? Nothing in particular. No addition. <laughs> I have been listening to a lot of old school stuff lately. Like, Ring My Bell is like an eight minute song. What, Patty the Bell? No, no, no. no. Mm -mm. What's the other name? Oh, but, oh, what is her name? That, I can't think of her name. Ring My Bell. <laughs> Ring My Bell. My Bell. Who did that? That's a good question. Why was I giving Patty the credit for that one? I don't know. Similar. Yeah. Patty be doing covers of everybody else's stuff for real. Oh, that's a cover? Oh, you think she may have did that? She may you? have did that one. Hmm. Yeah, back in here, just chill. This your first time sitting on the red couch? <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> what? I just made it a thing, man. <laughs> it definitely feels like show, a thing. My red couch <laughs> show. Yeah, what's up? Is this your first time on a red couch with us? Yeah. That sounds so crazy. This could go nice a couple different you. ways for me. It's good to have you. It's good to have you here. Yeah. No red couch. Now you need one. Okay. Yeah. 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 I remember I had a friend, he, used to, he got some leather couches. I mean, maybe they didn't dresses in stores somewhere. But I thought he was a blood at one point. You know, I was like, I got these red couches over here. Dude. It's red leather couch? Red leather couch. Wow, like a bright red? Bright red, just wow. like this color. I was like, yo, are you a blood? He was like, nah, nah, nah. We just, just got these joints. Probably got them joints on discount or something. <laughs> <laughs> red leather couch? Red leather couch. Choice was tough. I used to know this other dude that used to get furniture. You know, he used to sell dope too, so dope days used to come through with like little furniture and discounts. He had a whole white leather set off of selling drugs. Just. And somebody bought him that for drugs? Or yeah. <laughs> you know, they probably had a little discount at their job or something, or like mm -hmm. got him off the back, back of a truck. Gotcha. 
Yeah, people be getting a lot of stuff. He used to take a lot of products for drugs. Mm -hmm. Like, he was in the video games. People used to bring up old school Atari games and video games. Like, throwbacks, super throwbacks. And he, oh, I gotta take this one. Like, he a drug pawn shop. <laughs> A drug car. Yeah, he used to have all types of stuff. He had this one DJ joint when I was on my DJ joint. He was like, "Yeah, yo, I got this joint right here. I don't really know what to do with it, but you know, he he, he brought this joint over here. I thought, think you you might be able to do something with it. I'm like, I mean, it's cool and everything. It's been kind of old, but whatever. Ghostbusters. I did not see this joint. I'd be tired of remakes. They remake everything. This one is definitely um, updated though. The colors and everything mm -hmm. is nice in here. But who fuels the gender war? What you mean? Because was, the was there a necessary need to make it all females? It is women. So but I get what you're saying though. I think they just wanted to flip it. I don't think it's a gender war thing. It's not a gender war thing? I don't think so. Okay. Like, given the other side of, like, comedic actors right now, because back then it was the men, now it's the women. Just give it a different something. Okay. They couldn't come up with their own movie. Nobody can. Nobody can ever did. Right? <laughs> Nobody can. Nobody can. It doesn't seem like anybody's coming up with any original. Even the even the movies that come out come out as original, like the concept is pretty much identical to something you've already seen before. Very true. I'm Where's the fourth one? Ain't there four? Or the fourth one is the dude? I'm trying to look at them. I think it's... I don't know. I gotta look at them. Ghostbusters! Who you gonna call? Oh, and they got Marshmallow Man. OG, original pimping. No, it's one more lady. Mm-hmm. Yep, yep. That's what it is. Is this 13 minutes? Is that it? I felt like a long time. Felt like a long time, right? Especially when you're not, you're not used to being in front of the camera or just not. You don't got too much to talk about. We're trying to keep it PG, right? Thirteen minutes is still good. That's about the duration of the people that watch my day anyway. But if it's thirteen minutes, then they'll watch five. <laughs> yo, yo, people on YouTube be doing you dirty, man. For real, it be your people too. It be your people. Try to support. Try to throw videos out there just to get the little support. Ain't nobody got time for that. They watching. Whatever they got programmed in their Netflix, but it's, it'd be so crazy that people be giving so much time and some stuff on Netflix. They'll watch it on Netflix, they'll comment about it on Netflix, but when it comes to like personal, personal people, you know, they gotta really be interested, all the way invested. Yeah. So, geez. I appreciate the ones that fall through and check up on me. I ain't that brisk raspberry tea dude with bless me. But when I'm at the store, I never get it. I always get sweet tea, lived in joints. Because the sweet tea is good. 
Licking the bottle. Yeah. Not the breast? It's breast balance? Oh, both of them. Breast? Yeah, both of them. Yeah, but yeah, I know what you're talking about. I might breast. But I don't be getting the... The raspberry. The raspberry. I always just go for the regular, either lemon or sweet. The sweet tea. Yeah, the sweet tea is where it's at for real. Alright, diabetes in the bottle. Pretty much. I don't know where my next stop is, y'all. I'm gonna take it as it comes. Vegas to DC, DC to question mark. And that's how it goes. You think, you think, you think, um, Thing. Gay people and straight people should have different channels. Like a whole channel <laughs> where you don't gotta see no, no gay stuff. I don't think so. Yeah, I don't so. think we made it to that point. You don't think we made it? Out? <laughs> <I don't laughs> they got plenty of channels and everything. They got a whole BT, black channel. True. But to see, no, but that's like, I took it as like. Okay, a straight channel and a gay channel. On the straight channel, you don't have to see no gay stuff. On the gay channel, you don't have to see no straight stuff. They really be treated like that. Gay people, gay people always got that like that that talking point that nobody wants to see you being straight. Like they be saying something like that, or like nobody complains about you being straight. But I don't think we. I don't. I. I don't think we've gotten that far to the need of like separate channels. Even though I just see two sure. gay people kissing off an of HIV commercial, I didn't even see that. But I do think there is a channel that I don't know. That and I'm surprised they haven't had. Though. I'm surprised they haven't had. They haven't pushed for it themselves to get their own channel. Yeah, I think they have it. I think they do. They do. Not just on YouTube, they gotta. I feel like it could. It's very possible. It's called CBS, right? It's called ABC. <laughs> what does that mean? It's called NBC. <laughs> nah, I'm just pushing. Cause they be pushing their agendas. They Damn, man, come on. It's crazy. I wish I, I knew actors' names, yo. I wish your world wasn't like that. Oh right. Where I knew your name and not your character. And, and I see your face again in something a whole nother movie. No, and I'm just like, oh, that's Omar from The Wire. I mean, you could be, have made a conscious effort. But he had a name, I know. But every, I feel like that's sort of embedded in society. You gotta probably really be a thespian, sort of like, thespian lover. What's that? An actor lover. Thespian? It's acting. In what? English? That's English? Yeah. Just another word? <laughs> Pretty smart guy. That's weird. Sounds like a lesbian. I know, it does. <laughs> it's always had that like, little conversation. Yeah. That was an interesting topic right there. That was an interesting question. I need a little co-host that could come up with some random questions. <laughs> that one was... That was Wait, what was the question? Shit. Oh, should they have separate channels? Should the community have a, a separate channel? That was wild. Right? They be so offended when somebody, like, doesn't want to participate in the community, and they just like, well, nobody wants to see you two, kid, two straight people kissing, right? They just, now they don't want no romance in anything at all. Like, it'd be like that. Ghostbusters, this joint is tough though. They did their thing on this joint. Very um, digitized. How much acting did they really do? <laughs> did you get paid for this just to be jumping in front of a computer screen? You say how much acting did they have to do? <laughs> yeah. Don't do them. Because they just, you know, you strap them to a harness. How do they record all of this? You strap them to a harness in front of a green screen. Mm hmm. But are they're bouncing, they, they're pulling you on cords. But are they doing it at the same time or are they all separately and they piecing it together? Different different sections. Different sections that they're all together. 
some sections there. Uh, oh, true, true, because I have seen them do it together. You know? I don't know why I got such a problem with female heroes, and I'm just not, my mind is not wrapped around it yet. Female superheroes, really. That's the main thing, superheroes. I'm not good on superheroes anyway. I'm not like a Marvel fan, like, bro, it's got to be rooted in some kind of logic or some kind of reality somewhat. The last Marvel joint I really feel like I saw was Black Panther. And that's only because it was a little craze and my family was on there like, oh, we should sit down and watch it together. And I just sat down and fell asleep on that joint. Really? For so when? Your family? It was in the basement. My brother hosted oh, all like y'all. Oh, this was... Mother, aunt, on the couch. Oh, wow. No. Everybody was out. I think For my brother and the TV was dumb loud, so I'm surprised we even fell asleep. But you, know, you can't really put me. I mean, I'll be almost falling asleep at the movie theater if the movie ain't really like grabbing me. Mm -hmm. So if I'm in a couch and I know I can rewind it in my mind. Like I know I can press rewind at any time or just run it back. I'm asleep. That drone didn't really grab me. It didn't really hold my attention. I didn't get caught up in the hype. You gonna go see the second one? Was it already out? Mm -hmm. uh, did you go see it? Mm -hmm. Did that bomb? Did no, that... it did good. It did good. It did good? It just wasn't the super gas like the first one. I think it was well, maybe I wasn't paying, I wasn't paying attention because the first one was super gas. Like, everybody, <gasps> Ah, we're in a dashiki to the to the movie theater. Really? That shit was crazy. Wearing a dashiki to the movie theater, and this is not your normal dress. You're just just feeling good. You're you're getting caught up in the hype, and all that money went to Marvel, Universal. That's just. It's just ridiculous, sort of. It's very, very much a scheme, a plot, a ploy. That feels good. Massage things. I wish I knew some techniques. I don't know any massage techniques really. The calves is always where is that? So what's the plan for tonight again? Zip lining in the cold. Okay. I just said show is almost over. Show is coming to a countdown. What's that? Ten percent. I gotta stop it before. Gotta stop it. And I can't really see the battery. It's only 10%. Is it 10%? Will it show me? You think it'll show me when it goes down to nine? To nine? No. It's just gonna stay at that screen right there. It says ten percent. Yeah, pretty much. I don't know if they do a five, but five percent or not. But ah, we're gonna call it a day. This was a good video. Twenty-four minutes. I need little intervals. Couldn't get her on camera this time as we wanted, but the voiceovers will do for now. The view. We was in Vegas, we out here in Vegas, doing things. About to go zip lining. Try to do some of the, the touristy stuff.
We did some touristy stuff when we first got here. And you know, three days ain't a lot. Three days ain't a lot. Fresh off the plane, jet lag and whatnot. To the strip, to the hotel, back out to wherever. Breakfast on the on the wedding day. The wedding and the wedding reception. Supposed to come out. Yeah, we did miss a little opportunity that night. Supposed to come out that night. You know? Breakfast in the morning, I you know, I came out on my little spooky hours. I came out on the spooky hours. Breakfast or lunch, well not, yeah, a little lunch. Late nights, early mornings, so catch some Z's and come out for lunch. And then we gonna wrap this joint up. Vegas, baby. You gonna, yeah, you wanna hit the button? Oh. And she got off camera on purpose, yo.